What's up, big timers? Today we're gonna get a closer look at all of my Hot Wheels Super Treasure Hunts. And here we are, we are doing these super treasure hunts. First off, I'm gonna show you some older treasure hunts that I have gotten into my collection. And there's a few of them that are from like before super treasure hunts were around. But the first one is this one. So this one is called, what is it called? Midnight Auto. So Midnight Auto, and this was back in, it's dated as a 2002 casting. And if we get a closer look at it, it does have the real riders on there. So you can see the real riders right on there. So this was before they actually had super treasure hunts. They had treasure hunts and the treasure hunts still did have real riders on there. So this one I actually found in stores and I had it in my collection for a long time before I even knew what treasure hunts and super treasure hunts were. I collected this one and I found it and I'm like, whoa, this is kind of technically my first treasure hunt that I've ever found. So there it is, Midnight Auto, and I've got that one in the Protecto pack. The next one that I have is this one right here, and this one is a Volkswagen New Beetle Cup, and as you can see, this one does have the real riders on there as well. This one is dated as a 2005 casting, and this one I believe I got in my mystery box uh, that I purchased on eBay, so it came in the mystery box. It's a really, really cool casting. I'm actually really, really liking this one, so that one's pretty cool. Volkswagen New Beetle, and this one also before they called them Super Treasure Hunts, it was called a Treasure Hunt. So there's that one right there. And then this one, I believe, which is just a Treasure Hunt, but from the looks of it, it does look like it does have real riders on there. It's hard to tell within there, but it does look like real riders. And this one is, what is it called? The OCC Splitback. It's some sort of like uh, Harley Davidson motorbike type of thing. So really cool looking, I think it's pretty neat. So we collected that one. All right, let's go over the ones that we have here. Uh, let's start off with the, let's start off with the ones up here. So these are all of the 2018 super treasure hunts and treasure hunts that we have all right there. So there is our very first one, which is the Datsun pickup truck right there. So Datsun pickup truck number one for 2018. I've got them all in order. 2018 is a significant year when it comes to Hot Wheels because it is the year of the 50th anniversary of Hot Wheels. So pretty cool that we've got the 50th anniversary set of Super Treasure Hunts here. Next up, we've got the Nova. There it is, the Chevy Nova. Very, very cool casting right there. We've got the nice flame job on there and the real riders, of course. All of the new ones, of course, have the real riders and they most of them have the Spectra Flame paint job, which is the very, very nice looking kind of metallic looking paint job on there. So there is your Chevy Nova. Next one, we have a fan favorite. We've got the Lamborghini Aventador and I, I'm not sure if I have these exactly in the order, but Lamborghini Aventador and this is the Mira Homage Edition and there we have the real riders on there as well. Very, very cool. I really, really was looking forward to collecting this one, and this one was a nice one to have. Uh, then we've got the Mustang GT. I believe it's a 2015 Mustang GT. I'll take a look at 2015 Mustang GT with the Borla on the side of it. Very cool looking from the front. Spectra paint job. Not a lot of tampa work. We would have liked to have those tampa works on the back of it, but hey, it's still a nice looking car. And we'll put that one back up there. Then we've got the Nissan 2000 GTR. This one's become quite a collectible one as well. A lot of the GDM cars, the older GDM cars, the fans have really gone after. So it's got the little GTR logo on the back. So nice tempo work on the back front. Not a lot of tempo work, but still a pretty neat looking car. I'll put that one back. Uh, one of my favorites, I've loving, loving this one, the Indy Oval. Uh, this is the Indy Oval Super Treasure Hunt. We've seen a lot of different recolors of this in the main lines, but I, I just love this casting. I think it's a really, really cool casting. So there we have the Indy Oval rear riders with the slicks on there, which is really neat. So there we go. I'll put that one back. Then we've got the Tunes 1968 Mustang Fastback, also with the real riders. There they are. Uh, this one's a, it's a pretty neat casting, kind of an interesting casting to make into a Super Treasure Hunt, but we don't see a lot of tune Super Treasure Hunt, so they had that one from 2018. Uh, so we got two Mustangs for the 2018 Super Treasure Hunt. It's kind of interesting. I'd like to see them switch it up rather than go with two uh, of Mustangs or two of similar castings. Uh, then we've got a uh, muscle car. We've got the 2018 Camaro ZL1, is it? ZL1, yeah, 2017 ZL1. And there we go, we've got that one, nice looking green Spectra paint job. And then we can see it from below as well. 
And then we've got a, I think this is the Ford or Chevy pickup truck. Six, 52 Chevy uh, P, uh, TM GM, okay, trademark GM. Uh, there it is, the, the Chevy pickup truck with the Hot Wheels logo on the side of it. Neat looking from the top and from the back. Kind of an interesting color. It's kind of like a magenta looking Spectra flame paint job color. And this one, I think this one has to be my favorite Super Treasure Hunt of the 2018 year. The Porsche 934.5. I just love these wheels, the white wheels on there. Even the, the mainline casting of this one looks really, really cool. The big wing on there, the wide body kit on it. Such a fantastic looking casting. Porsche 934.5. Yes, my favorite Super Treasure Hunt. I know a lot of people would say, well, isn't the Lamborghini your favorite because you like exotics? But I don't know, just that the 934.5 just looks so cool. Next up, King Cuda. The King Cuda right there. Got that one with the King on there. We had the whole chest set from 2018, so it's pretty cool that they had the Super Treasure Hunt, the highest of the highest, the King, as a Super Treasure Hunt. That's pretty neat how they did that. They integrated that into the Super Treasure Hunts. There we go, we got the King Cuda. Uh, this one, a big fan favorite as well, one of my favorites for this year, uh, for the 2018 year, is the Audi RS6 Avant. And that one from a Super Treasure Hunt. I was, when this casting was announced, everyone was just really, really looking forward to it. So we finally got it, then it came out as a super, but such a cool looking casting. And uh, we've seen a recolor of it in a mainline already this year. Audi RS6 Avant. Uh, then we've got the Ford Escort. I think it's the RS 1600 uh, with the Hot Wheels logo on there. So we had the whole 50th anniversary Hot Wheels set and this one kind of matches that set. Number 14 TH logo right there on the side. Nice wheels on this one. Cool, cool looking wheels. They look really good. Obviously all the real riders on there and this one does have the 50th anniversary logo on there as well. And next up, I uh, have to say probably uh, the next two are probably kind of the, the disappointing ones uh, for 2018. I would have liked to see something better. Fiat 500, nothing wrong with the Fiat 500, but just kind of a, a blah super treasure hunt. Uh, but there it is, Fiat 500. The wheels look pretty cool. I do like the wheels on this one. Real riders on there. Very interesting casting that they chose though. Then we got probably the most interesting ca casting that they picked as a super treasure hunt, Coella DeVille. Was not expecting this one to be a super treasure hunt, uh, but the Coella de Ville, and it's very plasticky around here. It does have the real riders, the white walls. The white walls do look kind of cool, but yeah, not, not my ideal casting for a super treasure hunt to come out with from Hot Wheels. Uh, and then this one has to be probably the most significant one, the ultimate treasure hunt. Uh, for, uh, casting for 2018, kind of a bonus super treasure hunt, the ultimate treasure hunt, and of course it's the Bone Shaker, the Hot Wheels, most famous Hot Wheels uh, casting, one of the most famous castings of all time, the Bone Shaker, and this one just looks fantastic. The Spectra flame paint job on it. I love the wheels, I love the, the red line on the tires as well. They just look fantastic. Such a, such a cool casting, and if you guys watch my peg hunting videos, I did find one of these in uh, as a in my peg hunting. So this was, I think it was, it would be considered my first one that I've ever found in real life as far as a treasure hunt goes, or sorry, a super treasure hunt goes. Um, I was asking people, I was like, do you consider this a super treasure hunt? Because it's technically an ultimate. So I haven't really technically found a super treasure hunt. I've only found an ultimate treasure hunt in real life. And I found this one in Walmart. And I'm going to keep this one obviously encased and all that as a kind of a collectible variation because I do have one that's already opened right there. So we've got that one. Uh, we'll go down the line here. Next up, we've got the Greenwood 1976 Corvette Greenwood. Uh, and it's a, I just like this casting. I think this casting is really cool. This one, I believe I got this one. Did I get this one in my mystery box? I might've got this one in my mystery box. I can't remember exactly, uh, but this one looks super cool. The Greenwood kit on it. And this one is dated as a 2013. So it's either 2013 or 2014 uh, super treasure hunt. But I like this one. I think it's a really cool casting. Uh, and then we've got uh, another Fiat 500, and this one I did find in one of my case unboxings that I do. So uh, it was one of uh, one of three treasure hunts or super treasure hunts that I found inside of my cases, and this one I think was the first one that I found as a super. So first super treasure hunt I ever got in all of my case unboxings, and I've done probably 25 to 30 case unboxings so far. 
and I've only found three. So you can see the rarity. I did a video before about the rarity of super treasure hunts. And there you go, so about one in 10 cases have them. Uh, then we've got the Taito Off-Road Truck. I really like this one. This one's really cool. And uh, this one, I can't remember if I bought this one on eBay or I think this might've been one of the ones in the mystery box as well. Uh, but there it is. I don't buy a lot of super treasure hunts. I like to, I like to find them or I like to get them in my cases, but there we go. I think that one came in one of the mystery boxes. Uh, this one uh, is the Tesla Roadster. And this one really went up in value when they launched the Tesla Roadster into space. But this one's a really, really cool one. There it is, Tesla Roadster. Um, this one, I can't remember exactly where I got it. It might have been a mystery box as well. I think I got quite a few in the mystery box, um, but that one's really, really neat. I think if I didn't get this one in the mystery box, I probably would have bought it separately. I don't even know what the going prices of these ones are. Um, and this one is dated 2013, is it 2013 or 2015? 2015, there it is. Um, and that one, 2015, so it's probably a 2016 release. That's usually how they do it. And next up we've got the 92 Ford Mustang. This is a 2019 Super Treasure Hunt. And this one I did find in one of my case unboxings this year. And I was super excited to get this one. Uh, very, very cool looking Super Treasure Hunt, the 92 Ford Mustang. The real riders on there. Very cool new casting. I like the colors of this one as well. Looks, looks great, looks great. And this kind of goes back to my young days growing up when there's a lot of these uh, Mustangs, these five liter Mustangs going around, but I think it looks really, really neat. And next up, we've got another one that I found in my case unboxings. And this one, if you watch the case that I unboxed it on, I, I almost missed this one. I actually showed it, didn't think it was a super treasure. And then I went back or I think I did it as a live stream and people were like, hey, that's a super, that's a super. So that one is really, really cool. So that's a 2019 super, the Volkswagen T2 pickup truck. There we go. And this one, I think the wheels, they, they kind of like stagger or they, you can flip them a little bit. That's what a lot of people were saying. Um, I've chosen not to open it so far. I'm, I'm thinking if I get more of the 2019 Supers, I might open them up and then do a kind of display like that of all the 2019 Supers. But until then, we'll leave the 2019 Supers enclosed. And then we've got a 65 Mustang 2 plus 2 Fastback. I think I got this one in the mystery box as well. Um, but I think that one looks really cool. I think the wheels look really good on it. The Spectra Flame paint job. You can see a little bit of the dust on there. I've had these on display. And this one is dated as a 2013. So it's probably a 2014 release. 65 Ford Mustang GT 2 plus 2 Fastback. Or I guess they wouldn't call it a, G a GT. It's just the 2 plus 2. But there you have it, guys. Those are my super treasure hunts mixed in with a couple of the treasure hunts that we had right here as well. But let me know in the comments down below, guys, which is your favorite of the treasure hunts, super treasure hunts that I've shown you guys today. And thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.